That means the five times Paralympic champion, Jason Smith, the world champion, Ioannis Nambala, and the European champion, Matthias Michalski. Four times major medalist, Chad Perez here also. So let's go through the field then. Starting off with the White Tiger for Australia. Bronze in the 100 here, silver in the 200 in the last World Championships. For Australia, Chad Perez. First major championship in eight, went out in the heat to the 100 metres for Cuba, Valeris Lorondo Gutierrez. In lane seven, silver in the 100 metres in the last World Championships in Doha, disqualified in the 100 here for Brazil, Gustavo Enrique Arujo, full started. The reigning European champion over 100 and 200, the world champion in 2013 for Poland, Matthias Michalski. Also, para champion in 2012 in a different category. The reigning world champion from 2015 in Doha, won the 400 in 2013, Namibia, Ioannis Numbala. In lane four, the five-time Paralympic champion, six-time world champion for Ireland, the great Jason Smith. Lane three, four, Switzerland. Bronze in the 100 metres in the Europeans in Grisetto last year, Philip Handler. And in lane two, four, Morocco. Fourth in the 400 metres in the Asian Games 2014, Mohamed Katabou. 100 metres champion Scott Reardon has joined us briefly. Your thoughts, Scott? Uh, Jason Smith, he'll, he should get through this year quite easily. Um, it'll be a really close battle for, for the minor placings um, all the way back into fifth and sixth position. So here we go. Katabu in two, Handler three, Smith four, Nambala five, Michalski six, Arujo seven, Rano Gutierrez eight, Paris nine, the final of the men's 200 metres, T13. Further greatness awaits for Smith or for someone else. <laughs> Away first time, solid start by Smith, brilliant start by Smith in four, and by Mahowski, and by Paris, and by Arujo. This could be a real battle, closing for home, it's Jason Smith in that familiar position again, it's Jason Smith for Ireland in the lead, it's the ball in second place, Mahowski in third, Paris moving up, but Jason Smith's done it again, he's the champion of the London Olympic Stadium. Just like 2012, he's done the 100-200 double. Nabala second, Mahowski third, Paris four, 21-41. Jason Smith, unstoppable, world champion, seventh time. And another chapter is written in the book of one of the all-time greats. Season best by a long way. Nabala, the world champion, outgoing, gets a silver here. Mahowski, the European champion in third. The Irish strike hunter is out, and Jason Smith, a champion again. Yeah, what a what a great competitor. Jason yet again shows his class over this distance and over the 100 metres. He's, he's been the best Paralympic sprinter in the world for a number of years, and he continues to show uh, why he's the best. Well, Chad Paris, who's won four major championship medals, 100 metres here, training partner of you, fourth place this time. Yeah, I think Chad would be a little bit disappointed with that. He had an exceptional run in 2015 to come into the silver medal position and run a personal best there. So a little bit outside of that, he would have challenged uh, Nambala and, and Mahowski with, um, with the time he ran in Doha. But uh, credit to the other guys, they, they skidded that race um, perfectly and a uh, real challenge with Mahowski and, and, and the Brazilian to, uh, and, and Nambala as they approach the finish line. Absolutely scintillating start by Smith. He burned up the rest by halfway. And in this stadium where he'd already won three gold medals, set world records here as well. Out on his own in the closing 25, the big battle for the silver medal because the battle for gold had been won a long time earlier. Nambala dipping ahead of the European champion Mahowski for the silver medal. Paris out of it this time in fourth. But Jason Smith, what a magnificent athlete. He is a national hero back home in Ireland. It's his seventh world title and he does the double for the fifth global championship. The fastest Paralympian around. It doesn't get any better than that. Nambala doing very well though to get second place in the end though. 
Yeah, it was almost a, a contact sport as they in, uh, approached the finish line here. Nambala and Mahalski were, were elbowing it off as they approached the finish line. So, um, yeah, a bit of contact sport over the 200 metres. So Smith gets gold again for Ireland, their third of these games. Nambala, the silver in Namibia, Mahalski, the bronze for Poland.